Okay, so we're going to calculate the perimeter of some shapes, specifically this shape, uh, because Annie wants to build a fence around it. So my question is, I know how much fencing costs and will I have enough money to pay for the project? Which means that all I need to do is sort of add up all the lengths of the fence that I need and then work out whether I've got enough money. So the problem is I don't know yet how long is that top bit and, and how long is that bit there? So let's start by working these things out. So uh, the top length, uh, and I'll call it the bottom right length. Okay, so for the top length, it's going to be seven meters. Why? Well, it's six across there already, and then another one across there. So that one and that six make it be seven all the way across. Seven meters. Bottom right, this bit here. Uh, let's look. So it's five all the way up and down. I've got three here already. So three there and another two will make it be five all the way up and down. So if it's five all the way up and down, I've got three. I need two more there, two more there to make it add up to five for the whole height because it says so here. Okay, now it's easy. So to add up the perimeter, I'm going to do it in an organized way. You'd be surprised how many people make mistakes on this. So I'm going to start with this five and just go around in this order this way. So I'm adding up five plus one is six plus the two I just worked out is eight plus the six plus the three plus the one I, top seven I worked out. When I type all that in, I'll get 24 meters for the perimeter. So let's just finish it off. Um, fencing is apparently five pounds per meter. So if I get my 24 meters, that's how many times I need to pay fiber. So 24 times I need to pay the fiber. Uh, and that gives me 120 pounds for the total cost. So finally, I've got to justify my answer. I cannot get the mark without justifying my answer. So it's a sentence and it looks like this. Something like, no, I do not have enough money uh, because my money I need, 120 pounds, is more than the money I have, 100 pounds. So a full sentence that says no, the answer, because with a reason and using the maths numbers I've worked out.